Hey you everybody, it's Gamerator from the GameCube. Today we're playing Call of the Sea. We'll try this out for a little bit. It seems interesting, it's sort of, uh, from what I understand, like an atmospheric explorer puzzle game. With a possibly heart-wrenching story. We'll see. Look at the turtle back here. He's very upset. Did you brush your teeth this morning? Something like that. Um, but yeah, it's on the Humble Bundle this month. Looked pretty interesting. Thought I'd give it a go. Um, going in blind, so, as usual. Text language, English, subtitles on. Yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Whoosh. Okay. What was that? What are those voices? Indistinct elgent whisperings. We're in the water, a dreamland. Ah, the day star. Shall we entrevu? Whoa, we're wearing gloves. Do we need oxygens? We suspect no, this must be a dream, right? The indistinct whisperings of a dream. But us lets us know ahead of time what things are available. Where am I? In water. This pleasant lad. Very shiny. Shall we enter the cave of wonders? Are we missing like a, a cache of minerals not going towards the sun? Watch, it turns out you can just go back towards the sun and you'll wake up and go on with a totally normal day. I've been here before. Doors? Is that what clued you in? The doors? Oh, there's a clock. And it works underwater. It's a little bit crookedy. What is it? Nine fifteen <laughs> ish? Twenty? Nine twenty? Something like that. Great. A table. I've been here my entire life. I'm trapped in here. Bruh. We've only been dreaming for like five minutes. Though this this suggests the infinitesimal dread that is just understanding the situation in dreams, right? Like, oh no, this is just how it is. I suppose as long as you don't die of continual suffocation stairs. underwater. I'm climbing these stairs again. Swimming these stairs, if you please. What about? Can I touch her horn? <laughs> No horn touches. But hold on. Are you the sun? What? Invisible walls! My dismay. Eldritch whispers? I need to get out. The voices are calling me. Calling you to get out? Look, only stones for breakfast again. Whoa, look, I'm just trying to see the nature of this chair. Or is it actually not a chair at all? It's simply a cloak. In chair's clothing. No pictures? Where are your friends and family? Do you have any? <gasps> of course it must turn. My old music box. It's broken. I have to fix my old music box. I, I have to get it. I have to... Wake up. She's got the box. Those horrible dreams again. I've had them repeatedly ever since my mother died and left me that music box in her will. Tis cursed. Harry always said that old family heirloom had Look, something to do with spear. my family's strange disease. Strange disease, you say? If the doctors won't give us an answer about your illness, I'll search for one myself, you said. Just growing scales, eh? And in that search, it seems you lost yourself. I don't think I'd ever... 
pardon me, madam, but the island is in sight. We'll be lowering the boat in just a minute. Oh, uh, thank you so much, Captain Hodgson. I'll be right out. It's a harpoon, of course, not a spear, but still. All right, huh? time to gather my things. First, nap. It's early. Well, you can clearly tell by the angle of the sun over the sea in the hour of the day that we're clearly in the blue part of the world. Uh, we'll definitely take our diary, right? Know the gloves, for sure. What's first? Should we put on a dress? We're invisible, so we'll need a dress. What was I thinking when I brought all these dresses on this trip? Right? Trousers. Right you are. Trousers. Ah, the amazing cool. adventures of Nora Everhart. Art teacher. Art teacher. Very nice. Tab to open the journal. Nora, remember this? Everhart. 506. Nice. Curious things from my journey. Page one. Log. Oh, good heavens. There's a lot going on. All right, very good. <laughs> Lady Shannon Hort's crew. Ah. Uh -huh. It's just the one page, actually. Thank heavens. Oh, Lord. We're going backwards, actually. Oh, yes, of course. I suppose this would be the start. And this would be our current, eh? Okay, fair enough. Notes? That's our only note. Remember this. Huh. Left and right to change page. Or not. Someone has left a dusty apple. We'll need our gloves, obviously, to hide our hideous scale hands. Oh, I'd better cover up my hands before I leave the cabin. I wouldn't want anyone thinking I'm a circus freak. Just a regular leper. What do we got here? A map? I received a mysterious package at my house. I stored all its contents in my locked suitcase. Locked, of course. Hmm. Hmm. Delivered. Got it. Read? Play? Oh. I received a mysterious package at my home. Got it. <laughs> a radio is. I love though. this song. Oh my, I have the worst memory. I forgot the combination again. That's 506, Thank goodness, isn't it? I always bring my journal with me to write things down. 506, right? 506. Right? Push it a button. All right, now it's nice. open. Nailed it. I'm incredible. What is this cool? Find him. Harry Everhart. My husband, my partner, and my dear old pal. With his trusty revolver. Okay, read. Find him. That's what it says, all right. Got it. We'll save the best I saw for last. This island in one of my unsettling dreams. I drew it as soon as I woke up. Guess what? Oh, we'll take it with. Sure. This strange and sharp relic came in the package I received at home. Is it a dagger? A wing? A key? take. We can't take this one, though. We'll leave it safely at home. Alright, enough of that. We needed a little bit to get ready first thing in the morning. After spending so much time reading this book, I think I've learned a thing or two about Polynesian culture. Typical Karen. She knows everything now. Polynesian culture. Hey, can I get into this cool area? Is there a crouch button? Is it bound to see, like, some sort of hideousness? Already wearing clothes? What was I thinking when I brought all these dresses on this trip? Who knows? We should I'm head back to it. definitely going to miss this bed. Oh. Falling asleep to the ship's rocking was delightful. Some people like it. Some people don't. All right, I guess that's all of our belongings. I'd always dreamed of traveling. But it was not the same without you, Harry. If only. Oh, does time pass? Oh, no. Our clock has simply stopped. All right, P clock. It ticks, but...
it takes butt. All right, great. It's not exactly a clawfoot tub, but you can't always get what you want. Are you gonna wash your face or not? Oh, we've already put on our gloves. We've missed the opportunity to wash our face. Disaster. Merveille de Mer du Sud. Marvels of the Southern Seas, I think. Tahiti. All right. Let's grab our harpoon. Let's let's grab our harpoon. Let's bring it with. Obviously, some rope. Very necessary. All right, that's probably the. Uh, what a delight. That's all she wrote. I've still got to pack up a few more things. Nani. What else is there? Do we need to eat some breakfast? Have an apple? A dusty apple? What other things do we need to pack? Some elements that may be hidden. Oh. A dun, brass dun, key with a letter CW engraved on it. And some enigmatic instructions. 74 miles east of Otahite. Well, we'll be taking this, won't we? Now it's saved. Dresses again? That's probably it, right? Set, oh. The boat is ready. Thank you. Shall we okay, set Nora. to sea? From here on out, you're on your own. A family heirloom. Door closing. Lower the motorboat and be careful with Mrs. Everhart's equipment, lad. Motorboat is being lowered. We'll be back to pick you up in three days. I really hope you find your husband there, madam. I hope it too. Three we'll see days. you in three days then. <coughs> I hope you brought a good Be careful on that island. You know what the legends say about it. I'll take care. Thank you, Captain Hudson. Very kind that the uh is someone driving us there. Is the captain driving us well, there? Well, here I am, in the middle of the ocean after traveling across half the world. Just miles away from where my husband is supposed to be. Hmm. You left a year ago to Very search for steep. a cure for my affliction. Your letters kept me close to you. But suddenly they stopped coming. What happened, old pal? What did you find? Whatever it was, it led you to hire a crew and set sail from San Francisco to Tahiti. And from there, to this place. An island in the middle of the Pacific that the locals refuse to even name. It's lovely. Everything is familiar. It's so familiar. As impossible as that may sound, is this the island I dreamed about? Dun, 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 dun. This, this can't be a coincidence. Dreams are real. Call of the sea. I wonder if it's weird or endearing that she calls her husband by like pet names like old pal and colleague and stuff. What's with these palisades? These are not naturally occurring. Things. We'd be getting soaked right now as well. <laughs> Luckily, it only sprays out a cool Gillette shaving foam. Island, surrounded by deadly reefs and protected with stakes to keep anybody from entering. Why? Yeah, why? Truly, why? Plus, these are wooden stakes There's just hanging out in the ocean. It wouldn't last that long. Place. I have to come out and change them every month. Look, there's a little lean to made of. I guess. Is that a glove? A shell? A bit of pearl? Don't forget to drag your boat up. Uh. Oof. Now my tootsies are damp. Okay, Harry. Let's see if I can find any trace of you around here. An unexpectedly small I'll boat. I'll leave my things in the boat until I find somewhere to camp. That's wildly inappropriate. <laughs> And in fact, leaving the boat only this beached is wildly inappropriate. Unless this is high tide. I suppose in that case, maybe it'd be alright. I know it's just resin. What? It's just resin. Play? Play. I know it's just resonance, but oh, I resonance. do love listening to the sea in them. I thought she said resin. This is it's like just a little resin seashell. It's just, you know, made for the tourists. We're a little slow. Clearly man-made. A tent. 
So somebody was on this island recently. Blowing day flute, building day boat. Well, that's a vivo, a flute that the poet. Uh. No. Well, that's a vivo, a flute that the Polynesians play with their nose. I won't be playing that. With their nose, eh? Do 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 do. Nice. A miniature vaa, a Polynesian outrigger canoe, beautifully crafted too. It's got a mouth, two mouths, unless this is a booty. Nice. Does it let me put it down in like a different direction? That's wild. No. Okay. May have just been coincidence each of those times. You got anything else? Got any cool stuff? Potatoes? A sheep? One expects for a somewhat. There we are. A bit rusty. Can we read a it? Note written in French. French. I only understand two words: ill yes. and mort. Island death. and death. Okay. I'm sure that's French. It must be a warning about the dangers of the island. Can we get this This cool? machete is completely worn down. Yeah. The blade is dull. Foolish not bringing, like, a sharpening stone of some variety. Got some fronds. No, these are tracks, right? Look at these tracks. Can I examine them? Something has been dragged here. Yeah. Something was dragged to the sea. And by the looks of these marks, it was heavy. I would expect a small boat like this one. But perhaps no. Either way. Oh, spiked palisade as well. Okay. Should I visit the cave? The path? Or the spiked gate? Gate first, I think. Trudge, trudge. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Where'd you get those from, man? It looks like it opens from the other side. No doubt. Okay. Neat though. I think path last. Cave next. That's lovely though. A slow atmospheric trudge. I feel quite good. I dare say I might even walk a little faster than usual. Hmm. Useful. I dare say I might even sprint. Might even go for a nice morning jog. We'll see how far we can get without light. Oh, there's a bit. Tis more of a passage. What you got, bud? Those markings seem to represent the sea. I'll sure. make a note of them in my journal. It might come in handy. Boat, boat, boat. Got it. Triple boats. I'm sure that will come in handy. Sort of reminds me of mist a little bit, you know. I wonder if there's points where I won't want to sprint. Maybe they're dragging logs. Look, at these are nice clean cuts as well, all the way through. I wonder if the bark is particularly like... Who knows? I'm not a pond tree aficionado. I dare say I might go for a jog. Maybe even a bit of strafing. Who knows? How wild. These wooden figures are called Unu. Unu. This seems to be telling a story. Well, first there was a face. Blessed by the sun. Then there were eight dudes on an island. One of the dudes got lost in a maze. There were trees there. Oh. I've deciphered it. tree maze. Another story. Some more ubus. Watch out, you got some tree coming through here on your ubu platform. What's up? Okay, another happy blessed by the sun lad. But this time, there's two lads. In contention. But don't worry, a giant jaguar will help you. Alas, the jaguar died, but then there were four. They had a nice funeral with flowers. Then two dudes got lost in the tree maze. Oh my god. The tree maze claims another soul. What you got here? Bone fish hook. It's more like 
more stone than bone. Maybe it's the lighting? It's like jade or something, I don't know. The other one could be bone. We'll assume she knows what she's talking about. Wildly inappropriate, of course. <laughs> Indeterminate objects. Lots of hooks and fetishes and stuff. That's a very large bone, I must say. <laughs> That's what she said. Nice. Ooh, look at all the oohs. Hold on. Look peaceful, but clearly somebody wants to keep outsiders off this island. That's right. After all, uh, weaving together flower wreaths is the best way to ward off unwanted ne'er do wells, as opposed to wanted ne'er do wells, which of course is just woven palm fronds. Ugh. Many uwus. Okay, this time... Oh, this is before the jaguar died. They sacrificed a villager. That's why there was only four. But then three dudes got lost in the maze. Oh my god, they're all getting lost in the maze. What a disaster. A little knife? Don't mind if I a do. Carving tool. Oh. Hmm. It's got a bit of corrosion on it. Maybe some tape? Did someone put some tape on there? Foolish. Remember, point away from yourself, kids. And this a box. box. CW. Those are the initials on the brass key. Oh my gosh. I'll try it. It opens it. It works. So whoever sent me this key was here. Who could it possibly have been? Okay. The sun tack. Um is underneath. Okay, I got it. There's a hidden stone by the laurel wreaths. Got it. Let's check the back. Nothing in particular that I can discern. This okay. is starting to look like a scavenger hunt. I'm about it. I'm all about it. Hold on. I'll be back with the doorknob. Just wait for me. Let's go for a brisk jog. We're speedrunning. Could it be this suspicious stone? Oh, get wrecked. Wow. Turns out the oh, doorknob is actually immense. And just sort of... Okay. I don't know how that works as a doorknob, but I guess we'll find out. Maybe it's actually the faceplate. Let's see. Here's the fourth villager lost. So let's see. Three villagers took up arms against the fourth villager who developed a triangle problem. Oh, heavens. There's stuff on the back. Nora. Hey, Nora, check it out. I already what? checked it out, though. Someone carved my name in the back of this Unu. Yeah, the Uwu knows. Okay, great. The third Uwu. Maybe we should have been checking the backs all along. Okay, so. They've taken up arms against the Heart Lad. But then there's the Diamond Mountain. You must sail away from the Diamond Mountain. And then four people were lost in the maze. Oh my god. Then, the arrival of the Lad to the Square Tom Lads. Oh my god, it's actually just the origin of Teletubbies. But then he brought them back to the Diamond Mountain. And then five dudes were lost in the maze. And then finally, the Square Tums took up arms against the No Tums. And they were defeated. They built a palisade. A magnificent palace to the... Um... What did we call it? <laughs> Either way, six men lost in the tree maze. From what I've read, the Polynesians don't need doors. So why build such a big one? Well, obviously, the, um, the Uwu monster. Oh yeah, we were checking the backs. Nothing in particular. Very boring. Another. Nor- ah. Okay, fair. You gotta hold your hand a little. I understand. Was there anything on the back of this one? We really didn't check at all. It looks like no. We've taken a brisk jog for nothing. We've come up empty-handed, aside from a cute uwu face. Great. Wonderful. It's starting to get sweaty. From all this jogging. Oh, it's a pressure plate, actually. Okay, here, you can have this one. We've got the- we've got the goods. Pafonk. And then, pull the lever. The other lever? 
Uh oh. Counterweight. One of two. Next. Well, that did something. That's how it works. It sure do. Okay, good. Let's look at the mechanism. Very clever. Should we just leave the door open? They're clearly waiting for us. They even wrote our name on the invite. This may be the first time I trespass a private property. My childhood in Newburyport wasn't exactly the most thrilling thing. You've led a very dull life, and now you're very excited to be adventuring. We'll see how you feel tomorrow. Should we eat these fruits? These are actually just flowers. You can probably still eat them anyway. A butterfly. A flutterby. Uh. All right. Last tin of beans. Whoa, OMG! Very suspicious pakujas. We'll check. Is that Harry? Harry, you were here. You, you were. were here, and I found you. Damn it! Where are you now? Where is everybody? Okay. Where did you and all your crew go? There are six peoples. We're not going to look at the back of that one. Lady Contract Shannon? de passage. That name sounds familiar. I'd better check my journal. All right, Lady Shannon. Supplies for three weeks. Weapons and explosives. All right, great. Hold on, we have to check the back. Port de Popette. All right, great. Uh, three weeks worth of tins of beans, eh? Couldn't even leave one single bean. All right, let's check our journal. Yep, yep, we figured that out. By gosh, we got it. Uh huh. Waves, got it. That's a wave representation. Nice. I have a six. Right. Okay, okay. I gotcha. Right. Harry was on this island. Hope he's still here. Found a photo with all the expedition members, and I think I vaguely recognize some of them from the letters sent he sent me. But where did they go? Did they set up camp somewhere? Maybe many camps? Jesus Louise. All right. Nice. We'll check this one. What's in here? Anything cool? A mechanical bridge? That doesn't fit in with Polynesian traditions either. Really? We'll assume these are actually just full of sand, right? Just counterweights? They're not actually bodies or anything like that? That would be too weird. What you got here, fam? A puzzle? Ah. We've got a turnit and the lower of the two sides. Possibly with something we have yet to see. Five cylinders. Alright. I don't know if we've seen a set of five of anything, except for possibly the Ulus. Oh, Take a little jump. years since I took such a long walk. This fresh air is doing me wonders. Oh my god. Do you. This walk is very long? Turns out, I haven't gone for a 10 minute walk since I was a child. Let's see something shiny. Hold on, Dark Ulu. We'll be back. I saw a shiny thing down by the shore. I can feel the air is denser here in this mangrove swamp. Thank you for telling me that these are mangroves. And that it's a swamp. Are there, will there be leeches? Can we have some leeches? Should we boil up some leeches? Lovely, atmospheric, swampy. This is the mangrove swamp. Another dark ulu. Oh man, maybe there will be secrets. Getting our tootsies a little bit damp. We're not allowed to actually walk towards the sacred stones. Very well. So be it. Bridges are for suckers. Oh, what up? Oh, it's very dark here. Very dark indeed. Alright, what you got, Ubu? Yes. Yes, of course. Rays of sunlight shining through. Oh, Another okay. symbol. So let's see. One, two, three, four. Three something or others. 
Another symbol, suggesting we've seen other such symbols. This is probably the way we're supposed to come back, you know. Let's take a happy little jog back up the path. Okay. So here's the middle one, then. I see. The middle one is... What a beautiful mountainous landscape. Mountainous. Can I turn the mountain to inspect it? I cannot. Disaster. But we've drawn a little picture. Okay, so presumably we got like triple spikes, something, the middle. So there should be several, right? This is one of them. That's like that cool skiing mountain. Right on. Some fishes, so delicious. This sort of pond is a Polynesian fishing technique. Yeah. There's another symbol inside it. Yes. Cool sweet swish ski mountain. And we have to sort of guess because this is like is this the last one or the first one, right? I'm gonna guess the last one, Ski Mountain. Middle one, three sharp peaks. Should we go back as we find each one? Probably not. Oh, here's. Oh my gosh, many of them. Oh, oh my, dear. this is so beautiful. I thought oh, it would be a puzzle, what but now. What are these birds called? Uh, lorikeets. Cole's lorikeets. Lorikeets. Yeah. All right. I see your game. I must run away. <laughs> we'll consult the journal. Probably it'll have... Yeah, look. Man, this is why she's so slow doing everything. Look, she's ri drawn these pictures in color. Oh my god. There's actually a tremendous amount of information now. It's interesting, she's filling up pages that we haven't been to yet. Okay, got it. Ah, yeah. Mountain peak, sure. The sunlight, rays, a fishes. Okay, got it. Fairly helpful. Okay, 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 okay. Understood. Now that I've crossed half the world, I wouldn't mind crossing the other half. Very adventurous. I, I have to do it with you, old pal. Yeah. Old pal. Alright, so, got it. Maybe this is the first one, the sun's rays. And then we've taken this loop before. Alright, we'll have to go explore the others then. We only know, like, the first one, the last one, and the middle one. We need the two sides. We'll go in with the lorikeets. Let's see. Okay, you look like... And then we'll see about the other one. So this one probably, right? Looks like a wave. Maybe. It's not going like, hey, this one's important. You should pay attention to it. What you got down here? An invisible wall. Perfect. Wait, we just need to find ones of note for some reason. Is this the, the part that opens from the other side? Hello, birds. You did a little dance there. That was very interesting. How are you doing? Excuse me? Just coming through? Just briefly, uh, pardon me? There are lorikeet feathers scattered around this unu. I'll draw the symbol in my journal. Got it. Lorikeet burbs. And we'll take Polynesian some feathers, maybe. Chieftains make their head ornaments with lorikeet feathers. What a lovely souvenir. I'll leave it, though. Look, it's the doorknob. We can open it from the other side. Ugh, I've stabbed myself. 
That was careless. Here it is. A shortcut. That's convenient. It is, isn't it? But just back to the beach. Still? We've got through the gate. Magnificent. Maybe this one? What you got? What have you all got for me? I like how the birds came back. That's nice. The birds just like, yep, yep. This is my spot. You came here temporarily, but I'm back. Alright, well. I guess we'll press on. In the only direction we can go. Up, up, and away. OMG. Now that we've seen it. Can we sneak over? We must get to the barrel. We're stymied. Uh, this looks like cargo from an earlier voyage, long before Harry's expedition. Oh, uh, okay. It's cracked open anyway. Probably nothing useful inside. Sad. Excuse me, burbs. I'm not sure where to go now. Perhaps that was sufficient clues? I suppose if we have, um... Four of the five, actually. That does solve our problem, doesn't it? And after all, this one was... Which one was it? The bird one. We'll guess from... Oh, coordinated hops. How about that? We'll guess it's the second. So only the fourth, then, is the question mark. Another brisk jog. We're taking another lap. Harry said that he would go to the end of the world to find a cure. And by the looks of it, he wasn't lying. We promised we'd never lie to each other from the moment we started dating. Well, no first matter lie. how harsh the truth. All right. Let's see here. So, mountings? Was it the first or the last one? I've completely forgotten. Consult the journal. The first one? Sure. After all, I put this one way over here, even though it's the first one we found. Hold on. Okay, so... The sun was actually the first one, right? This reminds me of those slot machines that Harry and I saw at the Atlantic City Pier. What a Polynesian version. Right. And then the mounting was the last one. And the second one was the burbs. No, that's the fishes. There's the burbs. The sunlight was the first one. I forgot it. The fishes. Right. Then the mountains. And then whichever one we're missing, I suppose. Ah, the goalpost, of course. Wait, no. The waves were one. Okay, hold on. We'll consult the urinal. Hmm. So this suggests mountains, sun, fishes, waves, burbs. Mountains, sun, fishes, waves. Burr burbs. Go. Negative. Negative. Okay, so what if we did instead? Sunlight. Uh, oh look, there's extra. There's something else. Whatever this is. I don't remember the order now. I'm pretty sure the first one we found, like... And I'm only guessing based off of, like... The fingies on top missing, right? We'll go quickly recount. So, mangrove, nothing. So here's the first one. The middle one. Oh, the middle one. Middle one is the mountains. Last one is the fishes. Okay, well, there's your problem right there. Middle one is the mountains. Last one is the fishes. Trudge, trudge, 
Okay, middle one is the mountain. Last one is the fishes. Fishes. First one was the sun, right? And then this one was burbs. Well, I guess I hit the jackpot. Nailed it. That's my ticket across the river then. Correct, river. Nice, nice, nice. So, like, what's the order here, I guess? Well, who knows? Oh, yeah. I hit escape, but it's... Oh, wait. Is there some trick on here? Riri. Sunlight burbs, mountains, oceans, fish. I guess if we only paid attention, problem solved. Steady now. Steady, steady now. Mind not the bodies. Don't mind the children's sized bodies. What have we got? They look a little pointy. Huh? A little wander through the willow wisps. The day star. It burns. Lots of hooks and mandibles and such. Ooh, look at this very interesting rock. Hello, turtle. How are you? Are you good, stone turtle? I hope you're well. Great. Well, see you next time, stone turtle. It's getting dark. 74 miles east of Otaite. Sip, sip, sip. How long have I been walking? I've lost track of the time. Uh, about 40 minutes, give or take. That's a proper walk. Wow, mm -hmm. what is this place? Our village. Well, the previous guy's stuff. Better have a look no around doubt. this abandoned village. Harry's crew might have stayed here. Right, they might have. They might have erected this mighty stone obelisk with its disgruntled faces. Hello, what you got? This enormous stone slab looks like a mechanism to get up to the outcrop. Tis an elevator? Hmm, something missing here. Yes, we must put something in the D. That looks like sort of because it's like this side's kind of curved, maybe. A capital D. We got a turny totem. A tiki. Like something straight out of an adventure novel. Love it. Oh, he's beautiful. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's explore. The Everhard Expedition. They set up camp here. But, did they build these huts? Or were the huts here before? There were many boxes. Oh. No, interesting. We'll continue looking around. Another Could tiki. these tikis be some sort of guardians? Possibly. This one's got an upset tummy. Oh my gosh, what a lovely hammock. Polynesian okay? man covered in tattoos. I'm not sure if he looks angry or scared. He doesn't well, want to be near the what well? ruins. What is he so afraid of? That well. Bum bum bum. Interesting. So now you believe in magic, old pal? Old pal. Only Harry kept his. Amulets to each of us. Why would you throw it out? Seems careless. Some shells, very nice. A whacking stick, everyone needs one of those. Um. A, a bonking wood for the whacking stick, naturally. So we've got a nice little hammock. This is our home away from home. Oh, it's actually pretty nice. Tell you what. A turtle shell. Uh huh. Pictures. Looks like some of the crew members didn't get along too well. Don't go to the ruins. A okay. Ritual? Yeah, definitely probably some stabbing involved. Or maybe they eat some stuff that gives them upset tums. Oh my gosh. Uh -huh. Fascinating. 
ancient geometric stone structures are not Polynesian. What purpose did they serve? This was torn out of a binder. Fabulous. A nice little lattice or ladder or something of that nature. What have we got here? Another turtle shell? Jeez Louise. There's no way this still works, right? Let me record it. So, you said you've been on this island before. Yes. Some years ago. I made a rookie mistake. I did it from my fishing hood to go to what looked like a better spot. Less than an hour had gone. I went suddenly. My va'a. My canoe overturned. And I got this lovely souvenir from that mistake. Probably a scar. What gave you that scar? It's not a what, Bruce. but a who. I don't know. I didn't get a good look at it. But it seemed like a sea creature i never seen. A sea anyway, creature? I was lucky enough to reach that white sand beach. The one where we landed on the island. A man came three days later and got me out of there. Wham. He brought me to the port of Papete without speaking a single word. A mysterious Time savior. Passed, and I promised myself that I would go on with my life and forget about this damn island. <sighs> Why did you agree to return to the island then? I need to know what happened to me to discover the truth. I don't know if you get me. Absolutely. Sometimes you just have to know. Alright, is there anything more? Can we listen to it again? Let me record it. No. What's not? We didn't even rewind. What incredible technology. Alright. Some clues. Nothing definitive. We knew that they were coming, getting close to the wall, which was forbidden, where they had rituals where they eat too much and got upset tums. Understandable. Okay, the fish way. Got it. And this one? Oh dear, this is afterwards. He's vomiting. They're composed of four pieces. <coughs> My tum. It is the inevitable end. R.I.P. Breakfast. Oh, what you got in there? Some shiny corn something or other? The sweet king. Corn. Wow. Alright, alright. A cot. Fairly nice cot. Canvas cot. Interesting. Got some dice? I've never cared much for games of chance. How many pips? Oh my gosh, okay. I get it. Interesting. These are like rummy pips or something. What have we got here? This fella sounds pretty hot headed. Just doing nothing. Is this rich jerk gonna open that hatch anytime soon? I'm not gonna wait for Mr. Know it all again like I do with the elevator. You better let me handle the situation. We've got dynamite for a reason. Ay, ay, ay. Where explosives here? Dynamite sounds like a fool's errand to me. Truly. So here's our elevator with the D. The Delevator, if you will. 9.5 feet safe distance. Sure, I guess. Ancient hatchet. All right, he wants to go in. So this guy was a gambler, a note taker, a drawler. What we got here? <gasps> a pistole, missing. Uh, cleaning implements, maybe? Oh, this is like a ramrod. And his final meal, a bit of pears. What you got here? Nice a comb. comb. Yeah. T eighty eight. Yeah. Expensive. Uh, Who Rayon? knows this much about their appearance in a place like this? Truly. Got some razor blades as well. A broken mirror. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not a very good one. I can't even see myself. Oh, right. That's that's right. I'm a ghost. I have no self to see. Okay. Grooming kit thoroughly examined. Omg. The Winchester 12 gauge M12. Missing. We were packing a lot of heat when they came to this island. 
But they took all the guns with them. So maybe this was only five shotgun shells. Is that all you need? Very neat. Tidy. Huh? Quite a looker. A fashion model, maybe. Truly really the best stuntman in Hollywood. Wow, okay. All right. See you, Lou the Kiss. <laughs> Looks like this fellow was a real heartbreaker. What a rude dude. But tidy. His real name was Costas? Costas. Apostolo. From the United States of America. 306846. Photograph bearer. Okay, duly noted. And another count. Okay, so like the Hollywood looker with a gun, neat and tidy about everything. His appearance, his quarters, everything. And then this lad, the uh the hot tempered upstart. But who could draw? They shared a bunk. Nothing about these two except that this one likes turtles and had an upset tum. Alright. Should we go this way? Is this the way we came from? Yeah. Let's not go that way then. We've been. Okay. Did we see anything with fresh eyes? This was storage, really. Someone stayed here, but whom? It's uncertain. We can go this way. Aha! More huts. Pickaxe. Interesting. Oh, oh. Damn it. Someone on the expedition died. But how? Under what mysterious circumstances? Did they vomit themselves to death? What a delicate piece of craftsmanship. Yes. Very pointy teeth. And fins? <gasps> Mmm, American dynamite. Did they use all the dynamite? Turns out, 9.5 feet was not sufficient. It's barely a meter and a half. What is this? A farewell ah. message from a friend. Finish our game in the afterlife. Rest in peace, Pelly. Oops, we forgot to rotate. Drayton Motors. That's a fun touch. Roy, R.I.P. Was that our Hollywood guy? He seems confused, as if he was having a hard time writing this down. What happened? Well. Find out more about the well. Medical tent. Oh. Another bonkin thing. What you got there? They used the emblem as a headstone for Roy's grave. This one resembles a shark. Same. Maybe he got eated. OMG. He fell in the water. Shark is in the water. Bruce got him. Alright. Some hints. I don't think really. I never thought that this expedition would cause anybody's death. Oh, I'm sure Harry never thought so either. Sure, going he'd to mysterious places. Going to happen, he'd never have come here. Under mysterious circumstances. Sacrifice one I to save been another. I close to a grave since my mother's burial. Shortly after she died, my lovely Dalmatian spots, as Harry used to call them, appeared. We thought it was nothing at first. At first. But then body parts started falling off. Really inconvenient. Alright, what you got? Little wicker fishing baskets, is that what that is? Oh, this person liked to sleep out with nature. Why is this hammock so far from the rest of the campsite? Probably the guide. Look at this little fellow. Cute. Nice haircut as well. Beautiful. Whoa. 
Look at that booty. What you got? An amulet with a carved Marquesian cross. Ah. The symbol represents balance and protection. Not the sun? I've been lied to this whole time. Interesting formations. The river cuts through that canyon. It doesn't look safe to cross. Better not risk it. Not for this biscuit. Not yet. They've clearly been up and down as well. And most recently, down. Because the elevator is down. Alright. Our last remaining avenue du jour. We climb. Oh, it turns out you can just walk the back path to the elevator area anyway. Or is this some cool area? We're only the cool kids. The royalty got to stay. Ah, another bridge puzzle. Oh my gosh. They've clearly been inside. They needed all the dynamite, but in the end, they got it working. And had to build a bridge. Oh, I must have found the luxury huts. Pretty swanky. That's what I'm talking about. She knows. Oh. Love those guys. My God. What we got here? Ooh la la. Look at him. Giddy as a schoolboy. He's got a piece of rock. He loves it. Icor. Ooze. Okay, never mind, it's not a rock at all, it's some goop. He's just carrying it around in a towel, as you do. I've seen Harry keep even restaurant checks for bookkeeping. Mm -hmm. He would never tear up a piece of valuable information. Ridiculous. Clearly this part goes here. This part probably goes up along here someplace. No, hold on, don't be too hasty. Hmm. Hmm. Puzzles, okay. That seems to fit a bit better. Oh, you want to be snapped to that one. Alright, I understand. Oh, hold on. Let's arrange it a little bit better. Uh-huh. Yep. And then... Probably, yep. And this one? Mm-hmm. Then that one. This one goes way up here. This lad pokes in here. Get a little bit at the end. And let's not forget. A piece was given to each. Got it. Oh, I guess I'll look in my journal for the more cor correct version. Oh, look at these lads. Upset tum and then vomit time. Sag. Whoa. Okay. Right, 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 right. Log. Man, there's so much supplemental information. It's fascinating. Okay, great. Notes. But not helpful. Can I see the whole thing? Family symbols. They seem to represent sea creatures. Ah, I've jotted this down. The order of the symbols is important. What's the connection? with each tiki. Huh. A turtle, a shark, a manta, an octo. Got it. And the back? Nothing. Is that this? Yes. We found this one. Alright. No, no, no. Right click, right click. It's being ripped out the of something turtle. else. Why would you rip it out? Careless, old pal. Ah. The parts of the tiki on this column seem movable. Oh my gosh, more viable. Okay, I get it. I get it. So, it'll be... Oh my god. <laughs> it'll be the head of the turtle, the eyes of the shark, the mouth of the manta, and... Okay, this is probably shark boy? Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Which one is a turtle? This is our octo. This is our turtle. Okay, I understand. So, crown of the turtle. No, hold on. 
crown of the turtle. There it is. Beautiful crown of the turtle. Next. Oh, we can do it while puzzling. Uh, eyeballs of the shark. Very spookums. Yeah, we can we can do it right there. Hold on, is that even it? That might be it. Maybe it's not. That one. Yeah. Okay. Mouth of the manta, which is this one? Yeah, it must be, right? Okay, that's the one. And then the hands of Octo. Shabam. Cha cha. Nailed it. The king of puzzles, that's me. What mess did you get into, Harry? Oh. I see. Profitable. Caleb Bowen. The Starry Wisdom Society. How dare you. We'll crumple it up all back under the floor. Mr. Everhart. Frank seems to feel guilty for whatever happened. I feel really bad for him. Black Ooze was highly volatile. <gasps> oh my gosh. He tried to use the Black Ooze to blow it open. I get it. I get it. Uh huh. No the mechanism. It's an elevator. Wait, wait. Let's check the back. Nothing in particular. And you there? An object Interesting. here. Right, the curved D. Gotta fill the hole. Ancient mechanism? True. Considering how poorly Harry draws, this isn't half bad. Wow, rude. But I guess. Alright, let's see the secret chamber. What you got back here that's so important to hide? Whoa. Fancy stuff. Ah, the D. Okay, good. What a this lovely... This appears to be the shrine of a Polynesian chieftain. A lovely gown. What you got tucked back here? Oh, wow. Really old photo. The island is wearing a lot of tribal ornaments, but none of them seem Polynesian. Yeah. Let's see the back. Just some cardstock to keep it firm. Weekend it. <laughs> okay, yes. Nice. All right. What kind of stone is this? I've never seen any substance quite like it. Is this made it of? Feels uh, disturbing. I I suspect this is the device we need. Turns out, really, just a lodestone, a carved lodestone, big magnet. I'll take it. Thanks Impressive very much. Work. Is that a fish pattern? It's lovely either way. All right, I'll take this with me. Impressive work. Is that a fish pattern? Is that a fish pattern? Well, anyway. Wait. Wait. Did I see something mysterious? Let's go back in. Grunt of exertion. Turns out bending over is the hardest part. No, I would probably just glimpse the sunlight or something through. Glorious day. All right. I think we've done just about everything here. We found the secret key. Nothing in particular there. Uh huh. The icor. Hold on. There's a bit more. You put together yes. quite an expedition, Harry, and all just for little old me. Well, you know. Ah, okay. We'll have to address that in a sec. Might have to take a quick break here. We may go the full time to give this proper. Till the others. This explains why the campsite is nearly abandoned. Black Sand Beach. Something has happened to the ship. Look at all these in particular things are putting only what's indispensable. Alright. Let's take a quick break and we'll be right back. Whoosh.
Ah, we're back. Coffee's all topped up. Nice little stretchy. What else we got here? Other planes of existence. That's bats. Bats mad. Specific alignment. Resonance wave spectrum. Optical impression. Of course. Oh my goodness. Well, yes, I'm sure that's very fascinating. What else we got here? The ship. Right, right. Oh! In a moment. That seems to be a key feature of this particular... There's so many little beaten, beaten sticks. What you got here? Oh, I hope this is already unsealed. My dear old pal. Oh my gosh. I know you won't ever read this letter. I'm accustomed to writing you, and it comforts me in this strange place. This island is riddled with secrets. Mm. So many secrets. But I'm not only talking about mechanisms and contraptions, Laura. I dare say that something on the island you clouds one's judgment. Otherwise, I don't have an explanation for Roy's actions. The man was arrogant impulsive and a little cocky but he was no fool we weren't friends by any means but he didn't deserve what happened to him nobody deserves that no one deserves we death. may have made some progress in finding the cure for your illness but at what price i miss you so much nora harry he Jeez. may not say it explicitly but harry blames himself for roy's death i know him too well and I miss you too, Harry. Some scattered notes and documents. None of them of particular import, it seems. This one's a duplicate. What have we got here? Whoa. We've touched the mechanism. Ah, uh, yes. Get this strange device, Harry? Okay. We'll want to select a lens. There appears to be one missing. We'll start with the beginning. Pachomp, pachomp. Yes. I don't believe I have any notes on this particular device. Perhaps we'll need I'm to... I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works. Or what to do with it. True. The Harry of a heart I know would never have given up on this. Something must have happened that kept Can't him from solving the right it. right combination. What are we looking for? Something that's through the glass? One suspects? Black, Black ooze. ooze. In a telescope? Alright, we'll look at that. Black ooze in a telescope glass. Oh, right, right, right. The miasmeter. Jeepers, ah. A stranded ship. Something has happened to the ship. Thus, the trouble. I cannot rotate the ship. Try as I might. Okay, hold on. Something's missing here. A lens, of course. A lens goes here. And the black ooze lens is then inserted. And then we can see through the mind's Jesus. eye. A stranded ship. Or something like that. Wow. We love the intrigue. All right, jeepers creepers. So it's not that one, not this, one. not those, ones. not this, one. not that one. Why always three slashes and another? We haven't tried this one. But then there's dots. Lens aligner. Got it. The grid. The enlarging, the reduction. Ah. Ah, the lens itself. Mysterious. Got it. Well? I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it. Same. But we'll take the D. We'll take it up to the place. 
as I suspect that is our next journey. As they've blasted Harry their way hated through with asking his parents Michael. for money to fund this expedition. The Everhards are a wealthy Boston family. Quite old fashioned. They were never really pleased with his eldest marrying a middle class girl. That's oh why he God. wanted to get away middle from them class. as soon as he could. Just like his siblings did after him. Mm, yes. Nicey. Hoity toity high this society is no good. This stone slab looks like a mechanism to get up to the outcrop. Alright, insert the D. How, <laughs> how is that possible? What fascinating technology. That's unlocked. And we can push this for up. Oh, oh my! Ancient elevator, go up, please. Incredible. I'll also go ahead and stand on the inside. Presumably, oh that's where the mechanism here? lifts from. Or is it just a solid post? You cannot leap off. Probably for the best. This is actually a full solid post. The weight of this thing must be absolutely redonkulous. What happened here? Explosions. The black ooze. Uh, R.I.P. Medical bed soaked in blood. Where Roy met his last. Try as they might. One well, not soaked in blood. Perhaps this is where the doc stayed. What have we got? That black ooze again. Uh, that imbecile Roy blew the hatch to smithereens and blew himself up with it. Don't worry, Doc. Controlled detonation. Uh, I got splashed with that black ooze. Whole damn evening to clean it off. Oh my gosh. Skin alterations. Like like the ones on my hands. Hmm. Eczema. Cirrhosis. Let's hope not. Took samples of blood to analyze. Ask for a photo of Everhart's wife wife's hand. Ah. To see if it was similar. Again, the discarded memos. I can feel them. Spots on my skin are moving. Wow. You alright, bud? July. Uh, alright. Calling my name. Who's playing that music? Ah. Spider eyes. Big one, small one, small one, big one. Got it. Heavens. Stop it, stop it. He's losing his mind. Stop playing that music. I like it very much. Stop playing the music. I like it. It's wonderful music. Stop playing it. Nothing on the back. Losing his marbles. How are you doing, lad? Oh, happened Cripes. to take a snap. This man was splashed with that black liquid. Fires everywhere. Roy, I presume. Skaploosh. Whoever took this picture must have a really cool head. Truly. Unfortunately, you never have a picture of a photographer. Those ah. spots look all too familiar. Don't they? You've got some black ooze running through your veins. Is Not this nearly. a picture of my hand? Perhaps. Where did you get that? When did you get that? Erythrocytes. Hmm. Aren't those red blood cells? Hmm. One. Bum bum bum. Wait. Yes. Well, better take a look. Wait a minute. Is this what was in the doctor's blood? That ooze. That forms and unforms. Ooh, heavens. Can I rotate the black ooze? Negative. Still oozing away. All right. Well, we've learned a lot, and at the same time, Ugh, I can't stand the smell of medical equipment. Reminds truly. me of my illness. Illness, you say? Oh, look, you can send it down. But why? Black ooze boxes seem none the worse for wear. Oh yes, there was a fire. They're probably actually just charred. 
from the fire. Oh, some parts that got blown to smithereens. I'd better not touch it. But given what happened, they shouldn't have either. Truly. Why would he blow up the black ooze? The fool! Oh, heavens. Some portion of this was deeply corrosive. Is this stone structure a hatch of some sort? I suspect. And the way down lies here. But I want to check out this stuff. Can I go? No, not allowed. Can't turn on the lights? Another detonator, just in case. Some beans. Alright. Well, in we get. Well then, I'm going down. Come on, Nora. Deep breath. <gasps> we can look around somewhat. We can look up, but not down. Okay, we got some spots. The whispering voices. Is somebody whispering? Hello? Hello? Is anyone ah. down here? Alright. Do they have two pupils? Maybe. Are these ornamental? Or something else? Something else. Are these eyes related to the ritual? The ritual. Ah, uh, yes. Additional pupilization. Oh. This one is using a bit. This eye. Is it calling to me? That would be, um. questionable. I almost feel as if they're watching me. Yeah, that's an optical illusion. Very common. Yeah. I feel disoriented down here. Don't panic, Nora. Do they have two pupils? And a third questionable thing. This one's the only one with the ooze in it. Gross. Wait, wait. This one's got ooze now, too. Another eye. Ah, uh, I hear whispering. Uh oh. Uh oh. A third oozer. Oh dear. I hear it. I'd, I'd better draw it just in case. True. We're gonna turn around and see this is actually <gasps> whispering an it. eyeball. It stopped. Interesting. Was I imagining all that? The guns, they stopped. No more additional ooze. Alright, well. Spookums. What have we got? The guns. The guns. They're lights. Look, it's the man's. Where's the cool lizard dude? The Yagua. Don't see him. We've definitely got some cool ads in here, though. And these ones are in the ocean. They put the robots in the ocean. But then they shined up to the heavens with their starry eyes. Oh. This one's not it's as a ritual happy. of some sort. What are they doing to their eyes? Extracting the ooze from the eyeballs into their ooze jars. For the ooze lord. Of course. Of course. It's all coming together. Uh huh. You were close to something here, Harry. Let me see if I can solve Black it. Black ooze used to replicate ritual. Check. Tallingast pamphlet. Okay. Uh huh. This looks like another job by Handyman Harry. Handyman Harry. Replicate the ritual by putting ooze on the dots. Modify telling guests invention. Dare we modify? Maybe he heard the whispers too. Oddball ever since he was splashed with the black ooze and he's got worse after moving to the top of the cliff. Keep an eye on him, Frank. Very good of Frank to put all of his information on Dayton Motors. Uh, pamphlets? Everhart, University of Denver. Man. How old is this mural? It looks really ancient. Some of it's worn away despite being gold. Which does not corrode. Ah yes, we've made our way down. Another red taped lever. Oh, watch out there, friend. Drawbridge is lowered. 
Ah, a faster way oh, up that and down. Was easy. Oh, gosh, I love them. Uh-oh, Mr. Krabs. They're all very upset with you, Mr. Should Krabs. Some time. I should have sent the elevator back down. It is the ladder. That sort of looked like a ladder, after all. This should save some time. Golden. I wonder if we can call the elevator back down from there. Let's go look. Man, fascinating game. The intrigue. But now that we've seen the pupils, perhaps we have some inside information. Um, that's a bit, uh, raw fury. Mm. I believe this symbol means humble gawker of glamorous indie games. Brilliant. All right, all right. I see what you did there. All right, all right. <laughs> Good times. Oh look, there's a Tamagotchi. Mm, something's missing inside that emblem. Yeah. It's some sort of Polynesian coat of arms. Is that an octopus? Octopus -wa. And this one, the mantle is broken. It's broken, but I might as well draw what I can see of it in my journal. We figured out the rest. Hold on. We'll have to go back. Where is it? Where's the parts so that we can see? Probably under notes. Yes. There they are. Got it. Nailed it. A the map. Okay, so bottom left, top center, and far, far right, left. Interesting. Okay, we'll keep that page open. Let's see if we can go replicate that in some manner. Where we have to make these shapes with various lenses. It's gonna be awkward. But we'll see what we can do. Alright, thingamajig. It's time. Hmm. We want a low, big dot. And a left, middle, low, medium dot. Dear lord. Alright, thingamajig, let's go. Uh... Low, middle. Well, do we go as low as we can go? That seems about right. And then we'll be like. Pretty big dot, right? Hefty sized dot? Right. It's a massive dot, I don't know. Okay, now how do I do the next one? Oh, right. Does that seem right? Maybe this one? But what if? And this one was a bit bigger. Does that seem about right? Maybe. Hard to say, I don't know what that does. Okay, and now can we take this lens? Maybe that's right? sort of hard to tell. I think that's got to be right though, right? But this has not gone very, very high. Can we take this lens out of here? Presumably something will happen and it'll be like, oh, that's what you wanted. Ah. Oh, 
Oh, did that just wipe it off? Oh, I think it wiped it off. Right, right. Uh huh. Black ooze. All right, we'll try. What was the order we found them in, actually? Now that I say that. What was the order in the pit? That's probably what we should pay attention to. Let's go down and look. Can we run down? Can we slide? Like the cool kids? Ooh. Jog it in, jog it in. Okay, so this was the first one. It was the bottom and then left. And then this was the second one. And then this was the third one. So it is in the order. No, hold on. This was the first one. Uh huh. Pretty sure this was the second one, but maybe it wasn't. I forget now. Okay, well. Perhaps we misaligned it. We'll try again. Yes. Attempting to run up the ladder seems to do nothing in particular. Ladder wrapped with vines. Carefully at the top. That's where most people fall. The ladder suddenly moves. Disaster. Alright, huff puff machine, we'll go again. Should we try one of the other ones? Because this is obviously the smallest, medium. And then large, right? Because there's only like three sizes. You can try this one. You get a medium. And then it goes up. You get a small. Because that's as high as it can go. The meter. Okay. Oh, maybe we need all of them. That doesn't really make a lot of sense, but maybe. I don't know. We'll put this one at the bottom. In the middle, and it will be large. Then we'll put one in the middle. Wait, maybe we have to make the whole thing. This is a medium. And we'll go to the middle, to a medium one, and above that, a small one. Maybe that's too high? Hmm, good question. That's as high as it goes, it looks like. And there's one on this row, but all the way to the right, which is large. And then all the way to the left, but then up, like, either one or two. Oops. All the way to the left. Probably, right? And a small one. It's maxed out. But maybe this is at the top. And this one is also at the top. That doesn't exactly seem right. It's 
so I feel I feel that this is more accurate. So that would be all of them. But I can't need I can't do anything with that. The meter's maxed out. It's like, no oh man. Maximum other dimensions. Something's missing here. Jeepers. Jeepers. A stranded ship. Jeepers creepers. Hmm. Yes, alas, I'm not sure. I'm not sure at this point. I'd like to be able to take this lens. But we come all the way around. We'll reset it. Nice and clean. Meter's still maxed for some reason. I feel like individually each one of these things should be something. Medium dot. Small dot. Small dot. I'm really not sure. Maybe we should read our log and notes and stuff more. A shocking scene. Yeah. Uh-huh. Right. Notes. I get the puzzle, but I don't understand how to implement this puzzle. Their eyes. Whoops. And it's clearly like on the old miasmeter here. And I feel like it has to be like. It seems extremely straightforward. But I don't understand its implementation. Right? That's all the, the dots? A medium, a large. That seems like it. Can we examine this then? Do I have to move the dot back and do some special thing? I'm truly unsure. Let's read the instructions. When all else fails. Max charge house with square condenser boulder, double magazine rollers, heavy brass terminals on connecting cords. Incredibly expensive. Price without telescope. Still pretty expensive. Hmm, not super helpful. I see that we need to take the lens that once we've got the black ooze on it and put it on there. It's so frustrating. Truly, I can't find the right combination either. But this is apparently not it. Okay, so what if we just did one of them at a time? We haven't tried this one by itself yet. the big one. And then left. I wonder if these are closer. It's quite it's quite difficult to tell on this grid. Cuz is this the 4 spot or the 5 spot? Is nothing in the 5 spot? This looks like it's fairly far away. Maybe okay, hold on. Maybe this one's here. And this one is here. Maybe this one's actually taller. Maybe it's like this. Maybe this one's actually higher and this one's lower. Maybe that's been my problem this whole time.
This could also be here. Definitely not. Aha! Uh -huh. At last we yes. found the combination. I I solved it. Okay, I it was what I might be able to see with this lens. We'll be able to see darkness. We'll take it. We'll scribble some notes. Very nice. We'll chuck it in the thing. Cha cha! It fits. it fits, it sits. Locked it right up. Any more notes? Not that we can tell. And we'll glance. Oh my god. We're seeing beyond the abyss. What? What on earth? Is what is happening? Hmm. I don't even know. The wavy arms of destiny. Alright. We've taken a note of it. Log? Uh-huh. Uh mm -hmm. Quite a bit more stuff now. I'm trying to replicate the rituals. Murals tell a story. Click. God. Yes. Yes, I see. Maybe Jeebie's just thinking about it. Now, because this is, um... This space. <laughs> My That's God. space. What? What was that that I saw? What were those stars? We're seeing beyond. My God. What? <laughs> what was that that I saw? What were those stars? Now we have to find the star puzzle location. But I presume the vision. It's probably down here. Back in the pit. We shall descend. We'll see how much further we can get. Nothing to see here, except a ladder. Okay, good. I wonder if there's something if you descended that first. Probably not. Ah, thank goodness for all this Gillette cool blue foam. Alright, now which one are we uh, sketching on? The the salvaging one. We're doing something with this. It depicts a ritual of some sort. What are they doing to their eyes? Who knows, man? Ah. This is where we're doing the thing. This will take us further down. Okay, good. We need to see the path of the stars. So where do we begin? I wonder if it matters. Ah. This looks like a fancy star. This is where we begin. And so, we go zoop 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 zoop. Yeah? I can press these star-shaped tiles. We can press them. So if that's the first, that'll ease you. It's filling with ease. Ease. Probably, right? Oh, does it even show the debris? No. And then it's this. But then it's this, right? Yeah. Alright, looks like I solved it. We've solved it, alright. Push the ooze button. Oh wait, do we get some cool black symbiont action? Is it venom time? Great Scott! Oh no. the, the well is filling up. That, that's black ooze. Oh no. No, no, no. no. There's a ladder it's right happening. there. What's happening? I, I'm feeling faint again. There's a ladder right there. You could have just, just laddered it up. Turns out, this incredibly volatile black ooze. We just had, like, a whole island full of it. <laughs> And they just blew it up. What is this? Where am I? Dream time. Oh, look. That's the river. Am I dreaming again? Yes. We're walking along the river. I can look around. This is different. 
It isn't my recurring dream. Right. We need to warp over to that side now. Warmth with the power of blink. I can't stop walking. My legs aren't responding. Then just walk, bud. Then just walk. Let it be, let it be. What's up, bud? Merman's wimp. A little close Holy enough. Moses, what, what is that creature on the horizon? It is a creature. The most enormous merman you've ever seen. Hello. Wait a moment. I no, no, no. Oh, we're no. going over. That's fine though. We're just in the water. Wow. I I can breathe. Underwater. That was quite a quite a fall. I really don't recommend IRL. Look how shallow this is. You would have definitely smashed all of your bits. Well, actually, the viscosity of Gillette cool foam. Probably. <laughs> oh, we can swim faster, that's a delight. Okay, well, it's because we're not truly underwater, we're just uh, swimming around in Gillette cool foam. So, uh, everything's fine. I have to get back. I, I have to find... What? What do we have to find? Black ooze. Huh. Turns out, when submerged in Gillette cool foam, becomes sedimentary rock. Hello? Gorgles? The open sea? We better watch out for Bruce. Oh, hey bud. I expect if I what swim out that? here. What kind of creature is this? I shall be consumed. Well, do we have to go meet you, bud? Oh, he came down. Hello, mermans. Alright. We'll come over to you. Creature breathing. Hello, Finn. I need to get a closer look. Lure them in. Whoa. I knew it. <laughs> Incredible. And this takes us over to the Black Sands. We awaken on the Black Sand Beach. Uh, wh what happened? Oh, how did I get to this beach? Oh, well, you see, terrible headache. it's from breathing all that Gillette cool foam. Oh, look, someone threw their tires out as well. Chapter 3, Vanishing of the Lady Shannon. Well, I think that's a great place to leave it. What a delightful game. A fun little experience. Uh, available in the Humble Bundle, if you're interested, for this month. And uh, otherwise, just a cool little adventure game. Yeah, very delightful. Um, I might play some more. I don't know. Interesting. Interesting game. Uh, nice and fun. Especially if you like uh, atmospheric sort of exploration stuff. Super cool. But for now, we'll leave it there. Call of the Sea, everyone. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And until next time, friends, keep on cooperating. Bye.